What's up, it's Cinema Shogun here, and it's Armageddon time, baby. Is anyone excited? I know I sure am. Mm -mm. Oh, oh, sorry. I'm not talking about, like, the end of the world Armageddon. I'm not talking about, like, the biblical Armageddon, although I'm sure that's coming soon as well. No, I am talking about, like, the, was it 90s? I believe it was the 90s Bruce Willis movie Armageddon. You know the one that starred Ben Affleck when he was like rubbing those animal crackers all over that woman's stomach and like dipping it, dipping them in her belly button and stuff? Yeah, that movie. The one where asteroids are crashing into the earth and I guess our government decides that Bruce Willis and Ben Affleck are our only hope and they send them to the asteroid on a one-way flight in this weird spaceship and they try to destroy the asteroid with a nuclear bomb. Yeah, that movie. Well, it turns out when we watched that movie back in the day, we never knew that one day Armageddon would come true. But tonight, ladies and gentlemen, it is, <laughs> it is coming true. It's almost like hard to believe, but tonight, 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 NASA is going to fly a unmanned spacecraft directly into an asteroid, attempting to knock it out of its original gravitational pull, and I guess just send it somewhere else in space, maybe partially blow it up. Listen, I am not a scientist. I will let someone smarter than me explain it to you. In a galaxy where asteroids have pummeled planets for billions of years, now one planet strikes back. For the first time in our planet's history, NASA will test an asteroid deflection technique. It's the first planetary defense method of its kind. NASA's double asteroid redirection test will intentionally ram itself into an asteroid and alter its orbit forever. At the crossroads of science fiction and reality, DART is part of our plan to defend planet Earth against potential future impacts. The test to protect the future of our planet takes place today. Isn't it crazy? Like we're living in a time where we're about to see the first attempt at like a, at something that could save our planet in the future. You know, it's not that uncommon for asteroids to crash into planets and to almost totally destroy them. One would think or one would say that an asteroid striking into Earth is humanity's, one of humanity's greatest fears. One of humanity's greatest threats. One of the main things that could bring about the end of all humanity is an asteroid colliding into Earth. Now, I would argue that stupid people are more dangerous than asteroids. That's my argument. That dumb people will more than likely bring about the end of human civilization before an asteroid will. But you know what? I watched Armageddon as a kid. I enjoyed that movie, and it always gave me a fear that, hey, maybe one day we will get hit, hit by an asteroid randomly. But now, we have this system, or we're testing out this system, where we could defend the planet from asteroids and you name it. But here's my thing. All right, so the asteroid that we're going to send an unmanned spacecraft into tonight is an asteroid that's not a threat to us, right? It, it's some, it's an asteroid that we're not even worried about. And we're hoping to knock it out of its original gravitational pull into like another gravitational pull or something. You know, I'm not a scientist, okay? But we're trying to knock it out of its original path, if you will. What if we knock it out of its original path and somehow send it on a path in which it now heads our way? Wonder if we send it on a path that collides with another asteroid and it crashes together and forms other little asteroids that then come towards Earth. Is there any way that this can go wrong? I'm just scared a little bit, okay? 
I don't want to have to hear Aerosmith create another theme song for the end of our world as we know it, like they did back when the Armageddon movie released. <laughs> but seriously, this is an exciting moment. <clears throat> it's a historical moment. And as the world is paying attention to all the other little drama going on, this is the biggest news story happening today. This could literally mean, like this could mean that, how can I put this? This little test today could be the future of our world. You know what I mean? Like, this could save us in the future. If this test goes right and they're able to pull this off, then this could save all of humanity as we know it at any given time. And I think that's more important than half of the other stuff we're seeing on our news today. But I want to know your thoughts about this. Have you ever seen the movie Armageddon? Does this remind you of the movie Armageddon? Are you going to be paying attention to see how this all plays out? Do you think it will be a failure? Let me know all of your thoughts down in the comments below. While you're down there, hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button. Ring that notification bell. And I'll talk to you all on the next video.